I'm going to show you how to make a professional end credit throw using the Power Director Mobile Video Editor app. Let's roll out. We'll start off by adding our background. We'll tap on the media icon, tap on photo, tap on color board, we'll tap black, and we'll tap the plus sign. We want to change the duration to 10 seconds, so we're going to tap on duration. And we'll use the slider to move it up to 10 seconds. And we'll tap OK. Now we'll add a video that we want to use for the beginning of the end roll. So we'll make sure that our playhead is at the beginning of the color board. We'll tap on the media icon. We'll tap on video. We'll go to the location where the video is. We'll tap the video and we'll tap the plus sign. We want this to be five seconds. So we'll tap on the video and we'll place our finger at the end of the white bounding box and we'll drag this in until we're at five seconds. Next we'll tap on the transition icon and we'll make sure that we're on the basic tab and we'll tap on fade. Then we'll tap back. Next we'll add the end credit template. So we want to tap on the second clip to make sure that our playhead is right at the beginning of that clip. And then we'll tap on the overlay icon. We'll make sure that we're on the text tab. And we're going to scroll all the way over until we get to classic and we'll tap on that. We'll tap on ending credits 001 and we'll tap the plus sign and it'll add it right to where our playhead was. Now we're going to change the duration of this. We're going to place our finger at the end, hold on to the white bounding box and drag this out till it gets to the end of the clip. It's a snap into place. And we actually want this title to start when the fade starts. So we'll place our finger at the beginning and we'll drag this over so that it matches the beginning of the fade transition. If you're finding this tutorial useful, click clack that like button. It gives me an indication that I'm building an audience by creating helpful content for my viewers. Now we'll edit the text. I'm gonna place things in the order which I like for end roll credits. You can switch them up if you'd like. So we'll tap on edit text. I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste directed by tap this, select all, we'll grab this down and just have that section. I'm going to cut it. I'm going to tap near the top. I'm going to tap again and I'll tap paste. I'll hit enter. I'll hit enter again. I'll tap and I'll tap paste again. I'll hit enter and enter again. And I'm going to tap to cut and paste produced by. So I'll select all. Drag this down to it just as over produced by. I'll cut that out. And I'm going to place it under directed by. Now I'm going to change directed by to the title of my movie. Now the second directed by, I'll go ahead and change that to written and directed by because this is an original screenplay. I'll add the producer. And I'll add the cast. I'll add the music. And we'll add our special thanks to our PD peeps and team PDU. Once you've made all your edits, you want to tap on the check mark. 
and we'll go ahead and place our finger over the diagonal arrows here, hold it down, and we're going to resize this. We'll tap on the timeline, and we'll play this back. If you want to make an opening title intro for your video, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to smash my face to subscribe, hit me up with your comments, and drop me a like down below.